Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a video preview for your TVT listings. Now if you have not seen our previous video where I have shown you how to create a custom listing pictures, please watch that because we're going to be utilizing those cover images that we have made and make them into a video preview. So we have all of these pages for our video preview. And what I like to do is I like to grab music from either YouTube, specifically the YouTube Creator Studio, because it is in the public domain. You can use music from Canva if you go down to the audio. They have different music. You have to use like free if you don't have the pro version or what I like to do, I like to use Pixabay. And Pixabay is this um, website for royalty free images and royalty free stock. So I always go down to the music and then you can sort through the music that you want. If you want upbeat music, you can do that. And then all you have to do is download it. If you download it, all you have to do is drag it up into Canva to upload it, like we did with our files in the previous video. Now for me and my um, uploads, there's the audio section. Um, I typically have the same audio that I use every time it's sunshine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to mute this by turning the volume down. And then we're gonna talk about the timing of our video. So typically within video editing and video design, when you have text, you wanna be able to read it out loud for two whole times. So if I'm previewing this, I want to be able to say back to school worksheets, back to school worksheets, four worksheets, for worksheets, endless fun, endless fun, so that it's got plenty of time. Answer keys included, answers keys included. Just download, sit back, and relax. You're painting them this video, this idea of what they can do if they buy your product. So when we're looking at the timing of the music, you want to just kind of go through there and say it out loud so that you have time to register what this is about. And for me, with the amount of text that I have on each page, it equates to like five seconds. I'm going to go to my uh, uploads, add that in there, and I will go to audio effects. I like to fade out for one second because it naturally has a fade in, and then I will unmute it and then I will preview it. And then I like the way that looks. I will click share and then I will click download. Now you're going to want to download this as an MP4 video and then you will do all pages and then I click download. And this might take a few minutes to download because it is a bigger file. And then once it's downloaded, all you have to do is upload it in the video preview. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save this as back to school worksheet video and I will save that and then I'm going to go and I'm going to go to file and then I'm going to save this as um, worksheet template and it'll save it so once you're back at home in Canva you can go over to this dot dot dot, make a copy, and you have a copy of a worksheet template. 
what I will do is I will use this as a template. So every time I create a new product, a new worksheet template, I will create a copy of it, rename it, um, let's say fall worksheet. I will go in there and I will literally just drag and drop my new items in there. So I will delete these all out. I will drag and drop my new images in there, change the stuff accordingly, and that speeds up your upload process by having this template. So that is how I create a video preview. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and let me know below if you typically do video previews or do you do static previews? I would be interested to know which ones you use. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you next time.